Hi, my name's Dan, and this video is one in a series of videos I'm doing about uh, physics simulation in the Unreal Engine. And in this one, I'm going to talk about damping. Um, so that's not making things wet. Uh, you'll see what it means, uh, hopefully. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to um, add a cube from uh, the basic stuff in here and stick it in the world. And we're going to uh, simulate physics with that. So I'm just going to, on the right hand side in the uh, uh, in those settings there, simulate physics. So that will fall to the ground. I should be able to kick it around. A bit, it's got some weight to it, right? And I'm just going to take off the um, gravity. So I'm going to disable gravity from that. So that was this setting here. And so that now floats in the air. And it's easier to push around because it's not stuck on the ground. Okay. So I haven't done anything with the damping settings yet. Uh, so let's do that. There are two types of damping there's linear damping and angular damping. And both of those uh, are settings where, uh, which make it res uh, resist movement. So damping is like having, uh, having put it in treacle or something like that, or depending on how viscous it might be. But the two types of linear damping, so that's linear movement, uh, side to side, up, down, etc. And angular damping is rotation. So let's first of all show what happens if we... Um, Increase the linear damping to 15, which is pretty high. So it will resist being moved about, but it will still rotate quite nicely. There we go. We can push it, but it's really hard work to do so. Um, it doesn't like being moved, but it rotates nicely. Um, so that's linear damping, and we're going to swap those around. Uh, so I'm just going to take that back to 0 0.01, which is as it was, and stick a 15 on the angular damping. Okay, so that's, again, pretty high. So now it doesn't mind moving about, but it just doesn't like rotating very much. And we can uh, bounce it off things, and uh, let's run it on the wall here. And you'd imagine it would rotate more than that, but it doesn't. So um, I'm not quite sure what those settings would be useful for, uh, how you would set up like that. But that's linear damping and angular damping, and that's it from me for now. Mm -hmm. 